Purdue accompanist Jamie Newman is resigning after backlash from rape threats he made on social media against a pro-life student group. But that resignation has not settled the controversy. News 18's Kayla Sullivan reports students are still upset about what happened and she attended their rally outside President Mitch Daniels' office this afternoon. Kayla? These students, both pro-life and pro-choice, say they don't agree with how Purdue handled the threats involving Newman. A Purdue professor stood with the students against Newman's comments, but says he thinks the university handled it well. Rape is not a joke! Rape is not a joke! It's a statement these students all agree on, whether they are pro-life or pro-choice. That was clearly wrong. That was clearly outside of the bounds of anything that anyone here wants to express. He's referring to Purdue dance accompanist and composer Jamie Newman's comment on social media, saying he would offer to rape Tom's wife, daughter, and great-grandmother free of charge. This is not an event that takes one side or the other. This is an event that says that sexually explicit threats have no place on our university. Bragg wishes Purdue would have done more to show that. They tell us all the time that they take sexual assault very seriously. They tell us all the time that if we see something, we should do something with reference to sexual assault. We don't believe that the university actually did something. The uh, gentleman in question had to resign. Purdue professor David Koltick says he thinks the university handled the situation quite well. They may not have fired Newman, but they did offer him an ultimatum. And I think the administration made that very clear clear that if he did not recant, he was going to have to leave. Koltick says as a Purdue professor, he feels he has plenty of room for discourse, but believes Newman stepped beyond the limits. Threat uh, is not discourse. He says he's proud of the students for standing up for what they believe in. And I want to stand up with them to make sure that as a faculty member, I'm telling them discourse is important. We appreciate it so much. That's what we need at a university, and I fully, fully support you. Purdue refused to answer any follow-up questions about this incident, only stating they believe Newman's resignation is the appropriate outcome. Now, when I tried reaching the dance department, they also would not address Newman specifically. Kayla Sullivan, News 18.